So in our set that we have, we have these um, fairly small tubes of gouache. And so we want to really be careful how much paint we squeeze onto the page or the palette that we mix on. And you'll notice when you open up these gouaches that they're completely sealed. And inside the lid here is a point. So if you put that point on the tube, you will open it. Whoops, and that one had a lot of pressure in it. So sometimes paint is under a great deal of pressure when you first pop it, and that's what happened there. So I'm going to try and keep that Prussian blue um, pretty, pretty pure so that I can use it continuously through the process as I paint. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, as I said, I'm going to paint the first box a lemon yellow. Then I'm going to take a little bit of lemon yellow and I'm going to mix it with cerulean blue to see what kind of change happens. I may need to put more lemon yellow out and then I'm going to do the same thing with ultramarine blue and the same thing with the Prussian blue. For the next column I'm going to use my three greens that come in my set just to see what happens when I mix lemon yellow to these greens that are already in existence. And I'm also going to take my lemon yellow and I'm going to mix it with its complement, which is the purple. So there's a couple of things that we can think about and they are if we get come up with a different green for every yellow we mix with a blue, we also come up with a different purple for every blue we mix with every red. So using the um, tube purple, maybe that's going to give me the right yellow, I mean the right purple for my yellow. Um, we'll see. Okay? So right now I'm going to mix some paint and then I'll show you how I'm going to put it on.